Hi everyone. This one here is Tigger. We call him Tig for short. And he is similar colour like um, Ginge, but he hasn't got the circle on either side. So, yeah, we'll get stuck into um, shearing him. There you go, Dale. What you doing, mate? Eh? And plus, he was covered in fleas yes, as well. Yes, he was covered in fleas. This is the other one of the other two, Patch and gin Ginger. Um, he was a little feral when he was smaller. Now he's come good. So yeah, we'll get to him. Take his fur off. He's got a lot more fur than the others. It's almost like if he's going to... It looks like he's going to be a Persian because his fur is so soft. Um, we're not going to find out and by letting his fur grow and then him getting uh, a lot of fleas. So, with all ado, we will get to and do this little fella. Come on. He's not going to like this. He's going to really stress out. Come on, chin up. We mm -hmm. don't do it to hurt them. Mm -hmm. yeah, it looks like he will be a long hair Persian. Yeah. I think they... No, I think the other two are just ordinary domestic short air cats, but this one's a Persian. We still don't know. Um, come on, mate, stop contesting. We're still not sure on how long the fur will be to know whether he is going to be a Persian. It's a bit hard not knowing what they were when we didn't see the male, the male cat mate with the, the mother. So, yeah. So if he is a Persian, that's a win for us. Isn't it, mate, eh? Yeah, we're almost done your front. Come on. Come on, come on. Come here. Last thing to get that. There we go, you got it. No, oh, no. It's a bugger, isn't it? And if they weren't alive, those little buggers, eh? We wouldn't have to do this. Don't get rid of those fleas, mate. Keep them off ya. Come on, hang on. Hang on. Don't get in there. Don't get in there. Hang on. Hang on. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. 
Didn't mean to drag you, Mike. <laughs> You're trying to get away on me. You're a little handful. No, he's gonna go that way, okay. Oh, little bugger. I'm gonna roll you on your back. Oh, go for it. Meow. <laughs> Come on, that's enough. Please stop. No. 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 Please, no. Please. <laughs> He's really contesting. Yes. Wow! Pig. Pig. No. There I go. Turn him up on his back feet. Your hands are in the air, that's it. I think that'll do you, mate. Yep. Yep. That'll do you. Yep. Got the most of you. Now you think about it. That's going to multiply when it gets older. That little pile will turn into this little pile. Well, it won't be a little pile. So, yeah, that's him done. He looks a bit rough, but um, at least we can see around the neck, underneath the chest. When I'm not too concerned about the arms, about his front paws, anything like that. So, yeah, I'll put this in the bin. This is just a couple of short clips of what they looked like before we got them. Covered with fleas, as you can see in the video. Not real nice. So we actually cleaned them up. Got them all nice and clean. Mother is in the background, as seen. She's got a whole heap of fleas and eggs on her head. As you can see yourself, um, little one here, all fixed up. And the next clip is after they are all cleaned up with Garfield. Introducing Garfield and the four others to the three little ones. Gizmo. Patch Ginge They're a lot healthier now than what they were The mother could not even produce any milk That's another reason why we took them off the mother We had no choice They're certainly a lot happier As we can see Garfield's just enjoying the, the um, moment at the time. Checking him out. Don't you hurt him, Gary? That was when they were first 
not long introduced to us and in the next clip he's dusty with them all being shorn as we know them as now a lot more playful very happy I know they regret us from shearing them but it's for the best so if you like our videos please leave a comment subscribe give us a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video